gold with Vital Gold, the ultimate A to Z multivitamin and mineral. Welcome back. It's your Feel Good Breakfast Show Expresso here on SABC3. I'm with Andre de Plessis from Vital. And together today we're discussing nutrition and tuberculosis, and, uh, tuberculosis rather, and uh, how you can help your situation or even, uh, I don't know, could you actually prevent it by, by using these tips that you're going to be using or at least curb the tendency? Well, um, obviously nutrition plays such an important role in supporting your immune system. Yeah. So it can definitely um, strengthen your immune um, system mm -hmm. to reduce your risk of infections. Yeah. But I think um, testing is really an important thing if, mm -hmm. if you um, think that you've got TB or in, if you're in an area where there's a great prevalence. Yes. But where nutrition plays the biggest role is really in the support of the management yes. of TB. Yes. Because the disease itself and also the medication that's taken takes its toll on the body. Yes. Um, and the medication, which is such an important part of the management, also depletes certain nutrients from the body. Which you then need so, to replace. and your, your body needs the nutrition to recover. Most definitely. Yes. Yeah. So, we've asked you to please call us with any questions you may have on 083 913 3728. And we do have a call on the line right. right now. Hanali, good morning. Hello, Hanali. Hanali? I think she might be struggling to get through. We'll get back to her uh, when we get back, get her, get her on, the, on the line again. So let's talk about nutrition. So what are the kind of foods that one should be looking to get more in of, as you said, to replace those nutrients that the medication or the, the disease might yes. take away? If you look at the medication, it's quite a, a cocktail of um, antibiotics and other medicines to help um, kill the, the TB, basically. Mm -hmm. um, and the variety of medicines also um, compromise a variety of nutrients yes. in your body. So it's not a single food or a single nutrient, it's mm -hmm. all of them. Yes. So we're looking at healthy food and wholesome food. Mm -hmm. And especially, I think, with seasons changing now, with winter coming up, um, the, the most nutritious foods probably would be a stew with lots of vegetables or soups. Yes. We you include your onions and butternut and um, even spinach and lentils and beans that are highly nutritious. Yes. That contain a variety of those nutrients that support the immune system. Mm -hmm. So we're looking at nutrients like vitamin C, mm -hmm. zinc, selenium, vitamin A, vitamin D, the whole spectrum of wow. them. Yeah. So there is, is not a particular food item yeah. that's going to help. So it's, I it's a healthy diet. In that case, something like uh, the, vi the vital multi-time gold with, with all those nutrients would also, would also help. Yes. Right? Well, definitely. If, um, it's important to remember that a multivitamin contains small amounts of a big variety of nutrients. Yes. So that just tops up your, your nutritional intake. And why I say that is that you cannot replace a healthy diet with a supplement. Yeah. And specifically <laughs> with TB or any other infectious disease, it's so important to remember that even though the illness may take away your appetite yes. or the medication, it's still important to eat your regular okay. meals, have yeah. healthy snacks. Yeah. So how would you then go about it? Would you then kind of plan a, a meal kind of time every day? So knowing that at this time and this time you eat, that even though you don't feel hungry, you eat. Definitely. Yeah. Especially starting with breakfast. I think many people that skip breakfast, it, it really affects your appetite. So yeah. it's good to start with that meal. And then also, like, like you say, have a schedule with your meal plans yes. um, because that also encourages your appetite. I mean, it's ironic. One of the symptoms of a nutritional deficiency is a loss of appetite. Wow. So think about it. The disease itself can, can take away your appetite. The medication can. So if you eat less, the nutrient deficiencies that result from that will further affect your appetite. So that planning is important and wow. also to buy all those healthy, wholesome foods yes. Um, yes. that you make sure that you get that into your body. Yeah. Let's talk about the things to avoid. What are the absolutely no-go zones? You know what? Um, I would say that that's one place where I would really be strict on sugars um, and treats and um, snacks and things like that. Mm -hmm. Because if you look at potato chips and chocolate and sweets that we've indulge on over Easter weekend perhaps, mm -hmm, yeah. um, it's, there's really not a place for that um, if you look at somebody with TB and their high nutritional needs and their poor appetite because those are empty calories. Mm -hmm. So if you drink a glass of cool drink for instance, it brings no nutritional value to your body other than just providing wow. sugar. And yeah. somebody with, with TB definitely needs the energy, but also lots of nutrition. Yes. Vitamins, minerals, antioxidants. And the so nutrients obviously playing the more vital role than, uh, than just the energy that you need for exactly, that moment, right? Exactly, exactly. That's very important. So avoid those treats. Yes. Um, and also a healthy lifestyle, enough rest, enough water, all, all those basic yeah. rules of a healthy lifestyle. Well, Andrea, thank you very, very much. Amazing advice that you've got for us, as she always does, of course. And uh, of course, if you have any other questions, you're welcome to ask them on her Facebook page, Andrea Duplicy.
to see vital expert like it ask anything you want I mean literally I ask yes. anything anything and she'll <laughs> find the answer in some way or another right now we are crossing over to Liesl talking about a very very special Academy that's uh, as far as I understand brought about eight South African elite cyclists quite amazing Liesl over to you go for gold with vital gold the ultimate A to Z multivitamin and mineral Stay with Espresso and SABC3.